I can now imagine who I would have been if my father had chosen to stay in Tibet. I can now imagine why he chose to flee, clinging to the idea that a country can live on outside its own territory. I can now picture, as we sleep, every night, every month, every year, a never-ending stream of families escaping on foot, crossing the world's highest mountains in silence to deliver themselves from evil. Truth to tell, I found here nothing solid on which to base hope. Nothing more than six million bodies and souls under a yoke of suffering. <laughs> 